inheritance of one gene. Mendel's results can be explained using a specific example. Mendel crossed tall and dwarf pea plants to study the inheritance of one gene. Mendel observed that all the F1 progeny plants were tall, none were dwarf. He made similar observations for the other pairs of traits. He found that F1 always resembled either one of the parents, both parents was not seen in them. Mendel self-pollinated the tall F1 plants and found that in F2 generation some of offspring were dwarf. The characters that were not seen in F1 generation were now expressed. The proportion of plants that were dwarf were one-fourth of the F2 plants while three-fourths of F2 plants were tall. F1 are all tall and F2, both tall and dwarf, were expressed in the ratio of 3 is to 1. For instance, capital letter is used for the trait expressed at F1 stage and small alphabet for other trait, such as capital T for tall trait and small t for dwarf trait. Capital T and small t are alleles of each other. An individual having two identical alleles is known as homozygous, capital T, capital T, or small t, t. An individual having two different alleles will be called heterozygous or hybrid, capital T, small t. Phenotype the physical appearance of a trait, tall, dwarf. Genotype. The genetic makeup of an individual is called genotype, capital T, T, and small t, T. Dominant. The character which is expressed in F1 generation is called dominant trait, capital T. Recessive. The character which remained unexpressed or hidden in F1 generation is called recessive trait. Small t.